I'm Miroslav Popovic, but everybody calls me Nune. Uh, I am from Belgrade, Serbia, and I am the creator and owner of the Way Cables. I have visited Korea to officially launch uh, Way Cables at the Korean market at the Audio Expo Cell, uh, hosting by AV Plaza and our distributor, Mr. Lynx. I was always, uh, from my childhood, uh, was my, my, my first love was audio and music. And my first experience with the cables was when I was around 12 or 13 years old. But after that, I had a complex life circle that brings me to many other things that I have worked. Because uh, primar primarily, my vocation is poet, is writing. I was also journalist, I am also artist, and I have worked in the creative industry. But all of that time, that my life circle, I was, the audio was my passion and I was always thinking about it, read it about it, I was informed, etc, etc. And I was dreaming that one day, maybe, I will have an opportunity to be a part of audio industry. So, when I found how the cotton and silver works together. I had so strong feelings how much is that good then that the world should know that, know about that. Uh, at that moment I had my another businesses but because of that strong feeling inside of me that is something special, something uh, that I should do. I said, okay, now I will do that. And that is how the story was begun. Our main goal is to allow to be highly demanding audiophiles and music lovers to experience music deeply emotionally on the highest level. On the other side, to reach that, we are making cables that allows to components that are connected together to audio electronics that our cables are connecting to show their maximum possibilities in the sound meaning, their maximum sound features, which means that our job is to make neutral cables without adding any colorization to the sound, without adding any bases any highs, anything as possible, of course, because this is an endless journey. We can never say this is absolutely neutral. It is not, because we will finish our job already. The point is that our cables have exceptional neutrality that allows to electronics and works like some kind of instruments that will show you exactly if the connected electronics are natural partners, are achieving natural synergy, are good match or not. So, if the connected electronics uh, is appropriate match, if they reach synergy, uh, you will be rewarded using our cables with exceptional sound results. But 
On the other side, if the connected electronics are not good partners, are not naturally matching partners, you will notice that. Weak cables are 100% handmade products. We have limited cap capabilities because of that, but we have many advantage compared to the mass production manufacturers. Because we are making our cables is a, is a, I can describe it as a cooking. It is as a cooking process. When you are making cables as a, with the machines, you don't have so many options to try. Because it's a mass production. You have to try many possibilities, how it works. Uh, many times it is on the contrary of some logical, seem, seemingly logical process or against the law of physics. But, uh, you know, we are not scientists, I am not engineer. As an audiophile, audiophile a music lover, I am only interested in the sound results. So, you have to try. And we have we can to try a lot of time and we are trying constantly because we are hand making our cables. When you are working on our way with the hands, first you can do, and especially with the materials that we are using, you can only use your hands to make it. There is no machine that, then, that can make our cables for many reasons. The machines that are, uh, are made for making cables, for producing cables, uh, are not so gently, are not so sophisticated as the hand is. So, the hand is also very important in making of everything we like. Okay, we are first producing our own material. Uh, our basic material and the basic material for each cables is conductor material. So, uh, our, we produce our 5.9 five single crystal silver material. From that material, we are making wires. And that wires are in by our uh, needs in a different shapes, in a different diameters. And then each of that wire, each we are first hands polished and then manually insulated with the cotton. We have it a many different cotton materials that we are using depending on the cable geometry or design then we are start, starting to make cables geometry by hand also so depending on the cable type we are knitting it we are twisting it and preparing as a cable to finish it, we are also using another kind of cotton. All kinds of cotton are 100% cotton, specially made for us. And then we are also with the cotton making its outer jacket or sheet, as they said. After we got the half produced cables, we should make final points uh, to connect them, to attach the connectors, to assemble the connectors, which is not easy and which is very demanding. Each part of working, of making way cables, is very demanding process and requires very skillful artisans who are working on it because you should be very careful. 
For example, this is a cable with a diameter of 20 millimeters and it has a plug that accepts only 9, maximum 11 millimeters of the diameter of cable to come in. So, with the special tools, also by the hands, we are preparing these cables to allow two connectors to come to in and to make a connection point. And our connection point is also our way. And that is, I will let you know how we are doing. Uh, to avoid classic soldiering process and on that way to decrease the conductiveness of uh, our exceptional silver conductors, which are, by the way, all solid core, not leads. We are putting together wire di directly to the contact of the connector, and then we are putting soldering as a tear above to fix the wire directly to the connection point of the connector. When you got that, of course, because the cotton cables are very soft and uh, very users friendly, you can easily handle, but they also have some weaknesses. You know, the price of quality always requires some sacrifices. So we should develop and we were how to secure our cables for a long lasting using, for its durability. And we made it this part near the end of the connector, hard almost as a stone, which allows you to take it and handle it, connect it or disconnect it very easily without any care that you will destroy the cable. This part, this silver winding here, also acts as a damping. It has a damping function and uh, because the most of the vibration on each cable are at the part near the connector. So this slightly soft but hard as a stone part, accepting that vibrations and then the whole cable, because it's soft, it's made of cotton, acts as a fantastic anti-vibration protection to the signals, audio signals, which are especially um, sensitive to vibrations and micro vibrations. So we came to our findings. What allows the good sound? And for example, my explanation of using of cotton with the silver is that cotton makes crucial uh, benefit to silver because cotton acting neutral, neutral as its origin, if I can shortly describe. So less possible influence. It is very well known that the main influence to the conductors are coming from the dielectric materials. And now, of course, it is not just a cotton, as a cotton. The, it is also which cotton, how many cotton, etc., etc. There are some secrets also inside that I cannot share with you. But basically, it is because of its neutral impact that allowing neutral and that the, doesn't affect signals transmission. Uh, it is very interesting. In, uh, for the many people, they have wrong opinion that silver is sounding, I don't know, someone said cold, 
someone says harsh, with a lot of uh, uh, high tones, uh, some disbalances, etc., etc. If they will test it, our cables, they will see that we do not have such problems or issues. Moreover, many people say, oh my God, but this sound is not so much detailed as silver usually brings because of its superior, superior conductivity compared to any other material using for the conductors. But it also brings a huge stage, big depth and some warmth. And I said, no, 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 that warmth is coming from your electronics. They're neutral, but you're hearing how your electronics works. And they like also tubes, they like also solid state electronics. But, as I said once again, and this is maybe also important, uh, they are not made for uh, not well made electronics. Moreover, it will show you if the electronics or your system has a problem with the powering supply, with the hums inside the electronics. Classical cables are usually overly shielded, and because of that shielding, they are covering so many noise. But it is not a problem that they are covering the noise, they are also covering the signals, and the sound outcome is because of that uh, dual without a soul, without emotions, etc., etc. For example, we are sitting here in, a in, in front of the magnificent system, dream system, with the dream electronics. Uh, the high-end audio, most of it, uh, is so superior electronics. They can sound excellent or very good without any cables. When I'm joking, I said, you can connect these speakers with the iron wire and they will still sound it so fantastic. But what is interesting us is how they can sound indeed good. What is their maximum potential? Not just for the sound, don't forget, but for the emotional experience of listening to music. We have uh, practically all kinds of cables. Analog interconnects, of course, uh, as a balanced or RCA unbalanced and versions. Uh, digital cables, as uh, coax or SPD for IS EBU, XLRs, uh, also USB, and uh, we are very proud of our Ethernet cables. Uh, this is something very, very, very special and very different than any other cables we are making because we found that the Ethernet cables are, for example, even more sensitive than analog cables, which we didn't expect it at all. Uh, Ethernet cables should deliver so-called packages from one point to another. And if, if they deliver that packages, they work. So the revelation was how it can affect to the sound if you start to develop to develop and to pre, uh, making uh, some another approach to Ethernet cables for the sound purpose. And it was very interesting. So they're very, very sensitive, much more than anyone can expect by logical thinking. Another kind of cables are, of course, speaker cables and the power cables. 
speaker cables, same as analog interconnects, we all know their influences can be huge and it's very important. But what I want to point it out about the power cables. Power cables are also very delicate kind of cables for in the audio purposes. Because good power cable, or let's say very good, uh, can make, can allow, because they don't make, it allows uh, sound results, uh, big changes and improvements in sound results, the same as good analog interconnect cable. And what is the challenging in making of power cables? How you can make it? So they do no, not add anything. They do not add more bass. They do not add more highs, etc. How to be balanced? I will try to explain on this way. Many music lovers and audiophiles are using cables to combine or to fix some uh, problems or disbalance in overall sound they have. For example, someone will say, I, have a, uh, I don't have enough bass, but when I put this power cable, it brings me a bass. But if you put that power cable into the well-balanced system, it will bring much more bass that is not needed at all. So what's the point? The point is to make cables that will show you how your system works, not to improve their weaknesses with the bass or highs or meads or etc. And that kind of cables we are making. So it's a very difficult, it's a very challenging, it requests a lot of testes, tests, and comparing on the different systems and comparing different parts. It is not uh, allowed to everyone, but because we are making cables, we can do that. Uh, we're constantly working on development and improving our cables, our products. We are as I'm saying, on this endless journey. And the uh, Plus series represents our last level of quality that we achieve in the meanings of the sound results in the first place, but also in the techniques of making. Uh, so they are made better, more re re reliable, more secure, etc. Right? Uh, we have some, in, we had some improvements in the cotton materials, in the silver materials. We have also done some customization of the connectors we are using, and everything that brings the new level of quality. And uh, as I said because we constantly work on it, uh, on our development, in materials improvement, etc. Right? After several years of working on it, I can say, uh, we will have next year, as an, uh, for, uh, as an, uh, our 10th anniversary, new, new line of cables, and we will bring to the market uh, especially, I'm very proud and I cannot wait official launching. I think it will be in Munich next year, in May, I hope so, uh, of digital cables. Because our latest findings are how the digital cables, not just Ethernet that we developed new one and special one, but the classic digital cables 
such as coax or as ebu, ibu, can be fantastic. We completely rediscover and redefine design of the coax and IS Ibu cables and I can say the sound results are so amazing that I cannot wait for people to hear it. On the other side, the most advanced engineers of audio digital electronics see that it is also possible to allow uh, highly rated uh, uh, music files, DSD, no matter of its value, over the coax or IS Ibu. So I see coax and IS Ibu, including Ethernet cables, as a, uh, it will have brighter future if we start to be aware of their unused potential for the digital audio purpose. For us, as an audiophiles and music lovers too, same as a customer, we have the same goal, to enjoy music. We have it uh, representatives they, that can understand our work and are willing to do on the way we wish, thanks to Mr. Links, our distributor, and uh, AV Plaza, where you can see it and hear it on the best possible way. In Korea, we have a lot of customers. They, uh, they are using our previous series, MK2 or First Ones. And on this occasion, uh, I would like to invite them to contact you and to see the opportunities so they can get our new versions in a sound good trading or exchange program because my biggest wish is that that base of very satisfied users in Korea we have bring to another level to our mutual satisfaction our cable you cannot, you, you don't need, uh, and I don't advise, to buy without listening test. But because we have a, such a good representative that understands this approach, I'm inviting you to, co to be in consult, uh, to, to talk with our representatives here, and they will advise you which, ca which, ca which cable would be appropriate for your system so you could test it at your home, at your home environment, with your own system. Then, welcome to the club, welcome to the family of Wave Cables. Only if you will be satisfied with the results, and I'm sure many of them will be as much more than they expect,